This is the Minecraft Minions pack that's available. We're starting by just showing off the different character skins so you can see them in action. A few different crew options, you know, some of the iconic like characters and the villains and the heroes that are available. Uh, within the series, if you've watched the movies, you're probably familiar with a lot of these characters and where they come from. Oh, they've got a they've got the Minecraft thing on. That's pretty cool. But yeah, it's just kind of a neat world pack with a bit of a story. We'll be just working through it and uh, enjoying it. We're doing this in a, a live capacity because I'm on a, a bit of a time crunch today, but I thought it would be fun to kind of do this and, you know, show off the game and enjoy what it has to offer. So let's, uh, let's get building and, uh, well basically working through the story content as soon as it loads up here right pretty excited though because uh you know I've, I've heard i guess decently good things about this one and it's always fun to see what a new minecraft level is like and if you enjoy this type of live play of it let me know because typically i have to sit there and, and record these afterwards so it's nice to have this sort of live i have no idea when the next minions movie is coming out and this is taking a while to load this pack oh here we go oh it looks like it's uh quite a bit of an overhaul if it's changing the loading screen thing here don't worry it's it's getting ready it's just generating the world and everything like that come on minecraft <laughs> yeah we definitely need some optimized uh versions of this game for console that's that's for sure yeah okay it hasn't frozen still loading yeah, it's it's kind of cool, and, and normally, like I mentioned, I would just literally do a video showing this in action, but I thought streaming it would be uh, probably a lot faster if it ever loads. There we go. So we've already got the minions opening. I love the setup of the different areas now. You can kind of get like a... Oh, that's cool. They've got a scrolling credits. That's That's really interesting. Recommended settings for music and everything like that, supporting the developers, and we've got two modes. We've got adventure mode, or we've got sandbox mode. We're going to do adventure mode so that we can do the story, but the minions, they look really good. They they fit into the Minecraft experience c quite well, which is, you know, well, not too shocking, but great to see. And uh, yeah, we're, we're kind of doing the story here. We've got the Master Chief, and... Uh, Guess we gotta wait. I guess we're. <laughs> oh, we're going down to the lab. Okay. What are we doing? There's different levels of evilness that we have to do. Let, let's see the uh, meter that gauges how evil you are. Every 50 points, a, a new minion will be available to follow you. Oh, that's kind of cool. Hello there. Huh, kind of digging this. Oh, so it's like a bit of an open world sort of thing is going on with this one. Based off the new movie. Oh, Kid Grew, that's interesting. Lower city, got different sections, residential things. Might be a hidden powerful back at the record store. Okay. Sure, thanks. Can we get all these minions to come, or is it? Oh, it's just the one I'm imagining. My own personal mobile, which I, I assume I don't have any of these available. This is actually really quite well designed here. Mission progress. I guess it sort of wants me to get rolling here. Oh, I got the whole lab with all the minions chilling and stuff. I do have to escape through its sewers. A firefighter minion. Hmm. Recommend your secret tunnel to get out. It's the fastest way to the shop. Oh, so I get that. I, I turned them into a, a firefighter minion. Okay. There we go. And then they can do the job. It's awesome. Huh. Yeah, no, like, seriously, they keep doing these great packs with these different things. We've gotten, like, Frozen was really great. Uh, if you guys saw, like, the, the free maps with the Summer Festival, there was, like, the theme park was really cool, and... Yeah, this this is really interesting. Yes, this is a big city. Oh. Oh, and this creates like a map. Oh, so you throw it and it creates a map and tells you like where to go and stuff. Oh, that's that's really cool. 
wants another minion though, and then we got a collectible radar, and you can see if there's any collectibles. And objective clipboard. Go to the record shop and steal the artifact. Oh, we got a bat? <laughs> oh, that's that's kind of funny. A fully detailed city? Nice. This is interesting. Well, this is kind of cool. Vicious heist. Okay, should we, should we do this at the record store? The lair of Vicious Six we still have. We will have our ways. Okay. Leg work for minions. Well, where do we get these other minions? Their tiny bodies can be fit anywhere. Hmm. I love that there's like a cinematic here. That's, that's really cool to me. The Dragon Medallion. Isn't that what villains do, is steal from stuff? The answer is always yes. I'm gonna want to talk to him, okay. You know what I'm looking for. Listening to booth number two. Okay. Oh, that is really cool. And they got a record player. That is awesome. GTA vibes? I wouldn't say GTA, but... I used to... Oh, I got the minions here. Where Where is our minion? Is he still, is he still around here? Oh, what do we have over here? The sticky hand. This adventure needs someone to test it out. Okay. Give it a go. Oh. So we can use this as like a thing to bring stuff up. Ah. Huh. That is really quite interesting. And you kind of just use it as a way to get up to this place. Oh! This is a fancy tool. I've been caught! <laughs> so you have to redo it. That is that is actually hilariously well done. That is really clever that they were able to do that. Huh. Oh come on! Like you knew I was coming there. So we've actually got like a stealth mission that's really quite humorous. So he's gonna be Kind of looking, I guess. I guess when he looks the other way, I've got to go this way. And capture this box thing. And move it over here before he kind of looks around that way. Okay. Oh. That's kind of neat. I guess I need to bring the box up. So you can stick it to these different spots and you can kind of get up on it. Oh, that's pretty cool. I'm assuming this is a checkpoint. Is there like a hidden... Oh, there is a hidden collectible thing over here. I wonder if I can snap that box over. Can I get the box through here or is it got to go around? I think you got to kind of go around this way with that thing. And then go down this way. Might as well grab the collectible while we're here. Or whatever it is. Flashlight minion costume. Okay, so there's extra minion costumes you can unlock. Oh, that's pretty cool. Oh, come on. <laughs> huh. How do I get back up there? Do I have to get caught now? Well, that's not good. 
Oh, he got me. At least he gave me the checkpoint over here. Did I? Yeah, I get to keep the icon. Okay, that's that's simple then. Horrible performance minions. I'm out here giving it my all. Trying to be an evil thief person. This guy's got like a lot of henchmen. I feel like maybe Gru or whatever character I'm taking a hold of. Maybe she should get some proper henchmen. That might be the more helpful situation for this. <laughs> This is a really like clever tool. I'm actually kind of enjoying this setup here. Hmm. Oh, I have to go and open the thing. There we go, nice. I don't think this door is open, let's go this way. Over here, bulks. Nah, I, I need you up here, there we go. Oh, this is a very clever system. I wonder if each area has its own, uh, you know, kind of like weird tool thing that you use. Nice. What? Really? You got me there? Huh. I thought that was really, like, kind of a clever, clear getaway. Too bad we can't just bat these guys down. Oh, really? I gotta... Ah, ow, the box is, like, inside my character. There we go. Yeah, parkouring was never my, uh, never my strong suit in this series, that's for sure. Alright, so we knocked down the boxes, and then we've gotta watch out in case somebody's, like, looking this way, because they still guys looking there. Okay, I think we're good now. I just wasn't expecting that the first time. So I think we're kind of in the clear to get where we need to go, I believe. Let's see. Over here, bulks. Oh, so we'd have to turn off the fan to get to that. I don't really see a fan control switch anywhere, though. The question is, am I supposed to be going up that way, or can I go around? Oh, okay, so this is how I get to the fan. At, at least all the, the puzzle things don't like seem to be pretty obvious for like the collectibles. I, I don't think it should be too hard for you to kind of be able to collect them. A roller skating minion costume, that's cool. I'm just a little disappointed I don't have my little minion following me the whole time that I'm doing this adventure. I know that they're there in the outer world, but it would be nice to have them kind of following around at this spot. Hmm, okay. Closing corridor. <gasps> it's the Dragon Medallion! Mine! Do I, do I jump down? I have to escape. Do I, do I jump? Seems I, I don't think I'm supposed to jump. Mission tracker. Hollow map. Okay, let's see what we got here. Active clipboard. I can't transport while on a mission. Okay, I guess I gotta go the other way. Oh, this makes sense. Wait, do I have to go up that way to get out of here? Or what exactly is the situation that I'm doing? Is this the way out? Oh. There are a lot of bad guys around here. So... I grab this box. I guess the idea is not to... get caught by them, I suppose. 
Huh, okay. I don't really get the point of the boxes I'm knocking down. Do, 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 do. And I'm over here. Uh oh. Oh. I guess it's to distract them if I have to fall down and go this way. Huh. Bit odd. Very clearly supposed to skip, get go this way. It seems like there's supposed to be like guards around here or something like that. And uh yeah, hopefully this goes well. Hmm. It's a very cool level though so far. I'm really liking what they're putting together here. How am I supposed to like clear this gap exactly? Because I don't have enough running distance, I don't think, right? Oh no, I do, okay. As you can tell, I'm a master escape artist here. <laughs> There we go. And we're kind of moving fast here. I think I knocked that guard right out. I believe at this point I actually have to go down. That that is pretty funny though. Like the guard is like just straight up knocked out. Or am I supposed to keep going up? I don't know. Let's see, we've got this door opened. Now we can go this way. <laughs> <laughs> we are just straight up taking out these guards, are we? Oof. Don't worry, I'm sure they're fine, guys. They're just some guards here just doing their thing, their job, but, you know. Oh, the henchmen, I guess, maybe. Gotta give them their proper title, though. I'm sure they don't want to just be called guards. Henchmen is so much more intense. Okay, I guess I gotta actually parkour my way up this way. Would it kill the bad guys to put in, like, some proper stairs? I can actually jump up. Oh, jeez, I'm just rubbish at parkour. Am I supposed to actually get up that way? <sighs> I do not like this. Even the minor parkour is annoying. Seriously, you're killing me, game. In a regular video, I would just like edit this all out because I do not like parkour setup. Can I maybe go there we go, that's a better way to do it. Do the angle parkouring thing. Okay, so he's there. I gotta distract this guy and then go over here. There we go. Alrighty, where are we going? Oh geez, there's a lot of guys that we have to deal with. That's not a good scenario. Oh, you're right about the map. I accidentally did the titling there. Let me pause what I'm doing and fix that so people aren't uh, wondering. My bad. There we go, now the title's fixed. Anyways, let's keep going. So we got that thingy there that we got to get. And then we can go up higher. This is actually like a decently complex area. Is this door something you open? No. Feels like that door should be something you can open. So what is the point of this? It lets us get by these guys. Oh, I see. We can go down here. And then we can go this way. This is a very complex, like, system. It feels like an actual map that would be, like, you know, if they, if they were to make, like, a game based on Despicable Me or whatever, this would be, like, what they would use as a setup. Okay, then I grab that box. Okay, then I can get up here. I got it. Yep. Oh, no. Oh, there we go. I was like, that's not good. So do I want to go that way or this way? Does anyone else spell bananas? That's funny. It's the minion. That's actually a little fun little joke to throw in there. Oh, I thought I was falling to my death. I was like, oh no. Yeah, let's see. We got this thingy coming down. 
And then I'm assuming we can just escape and go back up the elevator. Alrighty then. Okay, let's get out of here. Excellent work. Excellent work indeed. Did I talk to this guy? I've got the thingy. EJ costume. Let's see. Let's put the, that there. Hello map, mission tracker, gadget, sticky hand, objective radar, clipboard. Okay. Do I need to do anything next? Okay. Chase race? We're doing a race? Okay. Let's do this race, guys. This is going to be intense. <laughs> I'm feeling the intense action of this already. Oh, and I didn't even realize we were racing. All right, let's go. The Master Chief is on the bike. Ow! Actually kind of launching stuff at you. You have to dodge things? This is a very unpleasant group of folks. Go squad, go! Who's gonna flatten me? <laughs> oh, you gotta wait for that to go. They caught me? Oh, come on! That is funny though. Alright, let's do that again. One. Maybe it's because I started late. I don't want to watch the cutscene thing again. Ugh. Alright, whatever. It doesn't matter. Let's do this. Let's see if we can actually get through this properly this time. Go! The Master Chief is zooming along. <laughs> I just love that he's throwing cars at you. This is one action packed racing scenario. You know, the city actually looks pretty detailed. Oh, it looks like there's a collectible that way if you go off the beaten path. I missed that. Dun -dun 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 -dun. I gotta remember if I hit the train thing, I guess I lose or whatever. There we go. You guys throw it like a train? Jeez. How is that a game? What? How is that a game over? That's a little ridiculous. You gotta watch this cutscene again. Oh. Uh, okay. Yeah, I know she's the leader thingy and blah blah blah. 
I know this is a little bit of a tricky race area actually not huge on this like it's pretty cool to do but kind of annoying that you hit something and you just like fail and have to like rewatch the same thing over and over again kind of drives me nuts Like it should just automatically get me to the part where I'm doing go if I fail so I can redo it instead of having to watch that segment over and over. It, there's literally no benefit of having me see that again. What are- what? Oh no, come on! This is horrible! <laughs> that is not fun at all. Okay, let's do it again. Jeez. I'll try to get the collectible this time, yeah. Maybe there's a setting where I can, like... Uh... It's not supposed to be a multiplayer game. How do I, uh... How do I get them out of here? So you can't just kick people, it's just... Ugh. Anyways, frustrating. One sec. Go, go, go! Oh, and then, because he's in the game, it disconnected it. Oh... That is so frustrating. This is, this is driving me crazy. All right, we'll we'll, we'll try to get to this time, guys. This this is frustrating. Oh, well, I was really enjoying this. <laughs> Alright, there we go, let's do it. Like, it should be a cool action-packed sequence, and then if you, like, mess up a little bit, you have to restart it and watch the like, cinematic over and over. Like, did they not test this and be like, oh, maybe somebody's gonna fail and have to, like, do it over and over again? <laughs> Okay, here we go. Let's let's get the collectible with the shortcut this time. The least we can do. Builder minion costume. Cool, cool, cool. Gonna collect all our little minion costume things, which are awesome to have. Roll. So we gotta wait for that thing to go by. Then we gotta wait for this thing to go by. And then this thing breaks down, and what, what do I do? Go around it? Oh, okay. Wh what? Why did they rejoin the match? Let me just make it more clear. <laughs> well, this is zero fun. Okay, so we gotta redo it again. This is kind of not good. <laughs> so do I, like how do I get around that part? Like I just get off the bike or something? Alright, well, at least we got the collectible. I can't believe I'm getting so caught up on this part of it. I should have actually done a film thing instead of a stream of this. This is not a very well done segment. Alright, let's go. Give me that medallion. Oh, you know it. Uh, okay, hopefully we can figure it out on the fly this time what it wants. Huh. 
Okay, so this is the side area to get the collectible. We got the collectible. We're going along here. This guy's gonna just drive by us. This thingy does its thingy, it goes by. This guy throws his thingy, this train thingy comes here, you have to wait for it to go. Then you go by, and then this thing drops. And it doesn't really tell you what to do. Am I supposed to just go buy it? Okay, I, I guess that counted. There's another collectible. Minion Knight. Oh, that's pretty cool. Then you just kind of keep going, and you're going between the things. Alrighty then. I think I've got it this time? I don't know. There's like a side path here. Alright. Just kind of believe. This is just a little... It's a little frustrating to do this part. You won't escape. Because it kind of like fails you and then it doesn't really tell you why you failed or something. And then it's like the... When the construction thing came down, it covers the middle of the path. Oh, damn. Fast boost <laughs> activated. Okay. Because that should be like a really cool segment and it's just kind of like exhausting almost. Oh, they're doing their minion thing. Our oh, operation, this would be greatly expected. Please wake. Walk up to each one and listen to our ideas. Okay. Do they want something from me? Digital map and surrounding areas and interesting locations. A storage box for your items. Just because you're a super villain doesn't mean you need to be messy. <laughs> Need their own space to your wall of trophies. Oh. It's the job done. So is this where it opens up or is there more like story content to this? Hmm. Visit Master Chow to train my minions. Oh cool. So we can make them like Ninja Masters? So glad I finished that. So we've got lots of minions now. You will be a builder. You are a knight. Because we don't need the hollow map. You will be a DJ. <laughs> I like this element of it. A flashlight? Oh no, I accidentally turned my DJ into a, a jail guy. Who wants to be the uh, the DJ? There we go. Okay, so you want a banana too? What about you? Okay. Let's take a look. We got the collectibles container, the lair teleporter. We're kind of building up our thing. We got our sticky hand thing. We've got- oh, well, there's all the collectible ones, so you can see them all on the shelf. That's, that's kind of neat. So do we, what's the fastest way back into the city? Is it like a vehicle selector, or what? Mission progress. Okay. I don't know if we just teleport back to where we're going. Upper San Francisco, okay. Interact to activate. Let's go, squad! <laughs> Interact to open the banana bag. Oh. Okay. What, what, what is this? Oh, I'm collecting bananas. Get the bananas! Yeah. Never did I think Master Chief would be uh, saving the world as a villain by eating bananas. This is a very weird scenario. Where are the rest of the bananas? How many bananas are here? I don't know if the bananas went this way. Did I get the ball? Why is there a big cloud moving through the world? Oh, there's bananas up this way, okay. Oh, there's 50 bananas? How am I supposed to get 50 bananas in that amount of time? 
I won with 41. Oh, I get it. It's like a team-based thing where you're competing to get the bananas. Alrighty. Okay. So the mission tracker says I need to go this way. Let's roll, guys. Let's make our way out there. Ooh, what's this? A fire ambushed. Raid. Defeat the raid to earn points. I don't really want to do that. Punch to vandalize. What happened to my minions? Was, was, weren't I like with a group of minions like just seconds ago? The fart bomb? Oh, okay. Kind of funny. That's what that guy was using to, to mess up my... My cart racing earlier. A little annoying. Interact. Punch to vandalize. I mean, I've got a bat. Am I just like supposed to hit things and break them? I guess I can't hurt citizens. Makes sense. Oh, so the thing you just... That's actually cool that they're able to make an interactive sort of goal type thing in the, the bottom bar there. You see on the screen the, the mission tracker. It actually just shows up in your inventory telling you where you're supposed to go. Hmm. I'm supposed to go the other way. Alrighty. Oh, cool. This is another one of our collectibles. A Kung Fu Minion costume. It looks like our minions need to be trained in Kung Fu. Yeah, it's for the little minions. I'm playing as a minion? <laughs> That's funny. Time to become a minion master. All my minions are here. I've obtained the nunchuck. Right on. Destroy the little monsters. Get them, minions, I think. It's like a cinematic. Alright, now we're going. Take on the bad guys. Huzzah! And this is where it's like everybody was kung fu fighting or something like that. Oh, like you could do like a fire charge? That's hilarious. <laughs> Down you go. Ow. I am learning the ways of the nunchuck. This is cool. What is that? <laughs> There's a huge enemy there. Get the minions! I don't know if my minions are, like, helping. Like, I think I'm playing as a minion, too, but... Yeah, it definitely doesn't seem like the minions are doing much. Still alive. Get them down, guys. Wave two of three? That's funny. Oh, I literally am a minion. Oh, this is hilarious. Let me go. Little minion. Ah. This is fun. Down you go. That big enemy looks terrifying and I don't have many hearts. Oh, <gasps> I've died as the minion. So if you die, you have to redo the whole thing? Is that what that is? Or do I get to continue? The stuff on this map is a bit weird. Okay. We have to like refight all the enemies or what what is this?
Now we got more enemies. Okay, let's do it, guys. Wah! Well done, indeed. Nobody expects the minion with the nunchuck. <laughs> okay, they, they overwhelmed me. <laughs> huh. This has got a bit of a curve for the, the younger ones that are going to be checking this out. Unknown died. Okay. I think my crew would be uh, helping out here, although they seem to have all left me the minions. Where did my minion pals go? There is something hilarious about seeing a little minion use a nunchuck, though. I find this part highly entertaining. There's more! They come in with such style, they use like the superhero landing. He's a big guy. Something funny about a little minion taking down like a big ninja warrior guy like this. Have two out of three? Oh, jeez. Okay, so you do literally have to start from the beginning if you fail and die. Can I eat bananas to increase my health? No. And this is again, like this has some really weird difficulty kind of curves for the younger ones out there. I think. I don't know. Between the race, it doesn't really make much sense in terms of what you're doing in it, and then this part. Eh. Yeah, these, uh, these minions are definitely combat upgraded. <laughs> Nobody ever expects to, like, just look at the little minion just beating up <laughs> these, like, obviously trained ninjas. They also do have a weird fire ability. Although I would love to see the minion in third person doing that. They definitely, they're crashing through the roof, they're coming down, they're breaking in. There's a little fire coming out of the minion. <sighs> That's funny. Ow. Ah, oh, that didn't do anything. Yeah, if you do the, the streak with it, it doesn't seem to do any damage, but if you do the, the roar fire, that's that's where the, the combat bonuses come in there. I don't think we have any gapples. We do have a fart bomb. They keep coming and attacking. There's too many of them. Did I get them all? Are they all gone? <gasps> it's just the big guy left. Oh, never mind. There's another wave of them. Go, go, go. This is not good. There we go, that was, that was most of them. There's, there's still more? They're relentless. Absolutely relentless. Did I whoop their butts? They kind of like killed me two or three times as a minion. I mean, I'm trying my best out here, but... Uh, that was exciting. What did we what did we learn here? New vehicles. Okay. Onwards to our next mission. Another villain wishes to meet me. Oh cool, cool, cool. He means rob the place. Villains are very trustworthy. This is this has got some funny uh funny dialogue in this one. We still the car? Oh yeah. The Master Chief. 
has got a Simpsons mobile. Dun 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 dun. Oh no, we're not going across the bridge. Okay. I mean, I didn't want to go there anyways. I didn't want to see what was beyond this area. Nope, not at all. Go, go, go. Is he right here? Oh, there's the wild heist. Okay, let's do it. That is cool. That is really cool. But it's his identity. The giant safe door. I've yet to been able to use this bat, and I am disappointed. Eighty twenty. That's a really bad share of profits. Okay, I gotta go steal the key. That's pretty easy. Uh oh. Pass the left corridor of the main hall and get another key. Alrighty then. Did I get an actual key in my inventory? Oh. My inventory gets like filled with all this stuff. Alright, now we're in another room here. A lot of stealth in this level. Is the key card under the carpet? I have no idea where we're gonna find this. Oh, I was on the table though. What? So they said carpet, right? Okay, go back to where we were. Alrighty then. It's a pretty serious heist. Ah, oh, here we go. Oh, that was close. That was very close. Amazing that they made these in Minecraft though, these guards. The next key is behind a painting. Ah, it got me. <laughs> Wait, was I going the wrong way? Yeah, that's the wrong way. Okay, so we gotta find a painting. They sure cover the uh, the grounds of these things. He's going around this robot. Now, I, I kind of wish we could attack the the robots, but it doesn't look like we can really hit the robots with anything. They're kind of like portal bots, aren't they? Ah, he got me again. <laughs> no, I don't want to keep going that way, but I keep not wanting to go that way. We check that. This guy looks this way. I wonder if we could actually hit this guy. Eh, I don't know. That's not what we're looking for. Not a vase that's behind a painting. Which painting is it? Oh. Double woe. Carpet. There's a painting. Not there either. Oh. How do you know where I am? 
Okay, let's just uh, not go with it. Why does it spawn you looking the wrong way? That's really weird. Do you think he'd see me if I just walk? I mean, he looks in this direction, so yeah, I mean, he'd be probably... No? Okay. How does you see me? Robot dialogue. Robots. Yeah, it's, it's weird that when I, I spawn, I'm like looking the wrong way, but I can jump past this guy. Oh no, never mind. Now I can't. What? Alrighty then. See, that one you can see that his red line goes that far. And he looks this way, and you can kind of go around. That's weird. That's very weird. There we go, I got it. Open the save, give me the key. Very animated and stuff, it's awesome. And then we got like a gun thing. The cheese ray. Use it on the guards, with pleasure. I'm turning them to cheddar. I think I heard something, I think I heard something. Uh huh. Now we gotta go to the lower area of the bank. Awesome! The lockers, there's disguises. Can I cheese the little robot? Oh. They're anti-cheese robots? This is ridiculous, so we gotta go find the lockers. Got like unlimited cheese ray, I guess. Funny. Yeah, I gotta put these minion costumes away. You have too much space. A DJ costume? Well, that's not what we're looking for, is it? Oh, maybe we gotta go to the other side. It's a lot easier with the guards all cheesed up. Aha. Uh -huh. Kind of funny. What costume are we looking for? I literally, they're all DJ costumes. What did this want me to do? Inside the left locker room. For disguises for us. They're just DJ costumes. All of them are DJ costumes. Am I supposed to be a DJ? Maybe there's an out- oh, is this it? No, that's a kung fu costume. <laughs> oh, there we go. Wild Knuckles Disguise. Do I just, like, hold it? How do I get this on? Wild Knuckles Disguise. Maybe I'm just supposed to bring it for us. Okay, then. Very unclear. Anyways, let's go bring it back to the main area. The anti-cheese robots. Oh, I got it, okay. Should be in one of the locks, lock, lock boxes on the center wall. Cheese gun! The center wall, oh jeez, that robot thing's back. That's cash, that looks pretty good to me. We're breaking in. I thought we already were broken in. Whatever. Let's do it, weird guy. 
Oh, does this mean we gotta go to like the middle room again? Can I sneak by this guy fast enough? Yep, okay, go. So now we're going back to the middle and we're, I guess we're gonna work through this area here. We got a drill? How do we get over, what? Okay. Drill is in, man. Get us the money. Where did he go? Is he like Ant Man? Alrighty then. Uh oh. <laughs> okay. Jump. Jump. Oh, come on. I actually have to put in an effort on this. Killing me. Jump. Jump. Oh, come on! <laughs> like, this is one of those things where it's, like, impossible to time, so you just gotta kinda go through it. Oh, did it, yep. Oh, the Mona Lisa. It's a booby trap. Good thing we've got a cheese gun. It's a very kid-friendly way to, to have a weapon. Nobody ever expects the great cheesing. You think they know something's up? Oh, there are a lot of guards. Holy. Master Chief is on the go. It is actually is quite impressive. Some of the stuff was a little frustrating at the start, but it's actually like a really impressive level. New minions have arrived at the lair? Oh yeah. Alright, what's the next mission? I don't want to do the minion bag thing again. There's ninjas out here on the streets? That's not good. I have been ambushed. They're impervious to banana attacks. <laughs> Ever want to see Master Chief use a nunchuck? <laughs> what a crazy time. What a crazy time. Alright, what's our next mission? I should have found a car. Pretty detailed streets, like, even the inside of the buildings have, like, stuff going on in them. Punch to vandalize. No, we're vandalizing. These ray or the shrink raid ruin their day. I kinda wanna do some shrink ray stuff. Final showdown. Oh, that was fast. It's the final showdown. Ba -ba -ba -ba. The anti-cheese ninjas. The vicious six and their new leader, Bell Bottom. <gasps> Long time no see punk. Ah, you chased me down and made me do an annoying race thing over and over again. Face my wrath of the cheese gun. Oh, <gasps> what a dramatic entrance! Criminally amazing. I get to choose options. It'll be a fight for the ages, guys. Is this the time to use my bat? What do you think's more deadly, the nunchucks or the baseball bat? Everybody was minion fighting. Ah. Ace this Gene Claude. Ace the power of my bat.
So do I get like health or do I just kind of die if I die? See, I've got the fart bomb. And the thing is, it's probably gonna make me restart the whole sequence if I die once, right? I beat the claw guy! Get ready to be exercised. That's funny. Is that a, is that a, a nun with a, a nunchuck? Oh, so the cheese rays does, does work? Oh, now the cheese ray works. Well, that's helpful. Cheese you later. Who's ready for a cheese down? You're looking mighty cheddared. Cheesy. Why does she still hit me with the nunchuck when I've cheesed her down? Have you been forsaken? That's funny. Who's this guy? It's vengeance. Taste my bat. Ooh. He's got some moves. This little tornado thing is like un unhittable there, or at least uncheesable. Wait, is my bat breaking? And why don't I have minions to help against this? He's really got some moves with those uh, rollerblades. I beat him down, guys. We got this. Who's next? I don't really have much health, though. Kind of a bit of an issue. It seems like health really does not well, regenerate pretty fast. Is the nunchuck to dodge? Heck is that? Oh, <gasps> he just deflected the cheese. I do wonder though, is, is like the nunchuck more effective? Is that what I should be using? Because it says use the nunchuck to dodge, but... I forgot, this thing's got like a charge ability, right? Oh, that doesn't seem to do any damage against him. Ace the nunchuck! I want to use the bat. Does that do any damage, the uh, explosive fireworks? I think I've almost beat this guy down. I beat down Stronghold, guys. Oh, never mind. He's, he's still up. I almost got him. Yeah, no range weapons, right? I just got, like, a cheese thing. I don't know if I can handle your chains. They didn't really give me much health. Oh! My bat broke!
Taste the cheese, Ray. I did it! Huzzah! I saved the land. Don't forget to thank my minions. I wouldn't be anywhere without them. I don't know. They haven't even really followed me around here. Farewell for now. Was that it? Are we, are we kind of finished here? That was the final showdown. Huh. I guess we go back to the lair and see what's going on there. That was a fast teleport. Anyways, it was uh, it was kind of a neat map. I think I want to look at the side areas to kind of get my thoughts on this, but it, it's actually kind of a uh, Vector's Fortress, Free Donania, the Moon. You can go to the Moon? Hmm. They're planning something in downtown. I have to find a way to take care of them. That's pretty dark. Fight some between villains. Go to Chinatown and face the thieves. What about the moon? I don't I want to go to the moon. Oh, you can go to the moon! What? Escape the prison cell? Well, this is, uh, unexpected. It looks like there's side missions you can do outside of doing the main thing. So that was, like, the main mission? Or was going to Chinatown to get the thing, thing back from the thieves part of the main story? The jelly launcher. What is wrong with these minions? Why do they look purpley? That is terrifying. That is absolutely terrifying. Minion saved out of 10 out of 100. Okay. We've got a, a purpley gun thingy. Is this like a side mission or is that my main objective here? It's just to save the minions. El Macho. Oh, this thing's kind of scary. Down you go, El Macho! Part of your plan? What is the next part of your master plan? Crossing this plane! With no survivors. <laughs> Bleh. 14 out of 100. Okay, so is there more to this? Or is that like... The end of it? You would think that this door might open. Is there anything like behind the door? Alrighty then. Because we killed the mutant guy. Is there anything else we're supposed to specifically be doing here? Some pretty scary music going on. Am I supposed to get up there? I'm really confused as to what this wants from me. I can add transport while I'm in a mission. Did it glitch or what? What is this? I, I don't follow what exactly I'm doing here. There's a top level. 
Uh, huh? Like, I'm pretty sure this door is supposed to open and I can go through it, right? Plasma jelly. Oh, okay. I guess I didn't notice this gun I was supposed to pick up. My bad. Fifteen out of a hundred. Ooh, righty then. Gotta save the minions. Oh, <gasps> it's Balzar Brat. Your music better not have copyright to it or I'm gonna be angry. Oh, you killed me? I don't really get much of an option to move around here. He's got the tunes. I know this guy. I've seen the movie he's from. Escape? I feel like I'm supposed to do more before I escape. I need to save more of these minions. Or can I not get back up here? Oh, okay, well. Too bad for the minions, I guess. Oh, okay. Oh, there's more. <laughs> Collectible! The maid minion costume? Really? That's funny. I feel like there's a whole part of the ship I didn't get to ex- or the moon base I didn't get to explore there. There are space rockets. Oh, he flies around. That's exciting. Prepare to taste the plasma blast as my minion takes it to you. Huzzah! Try using the sticky hand to pull them. Pull them where? Why am I getting attacked by these things from behind? Not appreciate this one bit. Down, minions, down! Kind of annoying while I'm trying to fight this guy. Did you say goober? That's not very nice. They gotta free these minions from the cages. Although I haven't found that the minions have really done much to like assist me this whole whole experience. They're just kind of there as like background characters. Except for when you play as one, I guess. Down you go! I saved all the minions! Yeah! Did you just crash outside the space station? Friendly mutant minion thing. Are we escaping? Let's get out of this base. Let's go, crew. You're not playing as a human, that's fine. You're gonna be left here on the moon. Catch you on the flip. That was like an extra mission? Home 
town. Yeah, not specifically sure where I'm supposed to go now. So we've done all the missions. Mission progress. We've got this stuff. There's like one collectible I'm not missing. Oh, it's because it's the one they stole and I have to stole, steal back. And then these are like minion progression, you get better things. And yeah, you can play this cooperatively. El Macho's mission. I think I'm supposed to go downstairs. Oh, I did not mean to do the stink bomb of the fart bomb. Lair teleporter, Chinatown. Uh, let's go to Rat's Lair. So where do we? Where were we supposed to go? Uh, eager. Get up to. Go beat. Not just all balls are brat. Oh, okay. So devices. Something about the moon. Anti-villain league. Thing in Chinatown. Okay, we gotta go to Chinatown. There's a submarine you can go to. Redonania. Chinatown, but yeah, there's like a whole bunch of stuff you can go do, I guess, outside of like the initial missions that I did. What are they planning? Whatever it is, they must be stopped. But yeah, there's actually quite a bit of content to this one. I say I want to say overall enjoyable. It's it's got like some really well done storytelling and uh, mission structure and setup and neat stealth segments. I did find that some of the fail mission things were a little frustrating to deal with, but uh, for the most part, a, a pretty creative offering. Are they down to the bottom of the beach here? Or are we supposed to cross the thing? Hmm. I think we're supposed to go across the bridge, but it said there's something going on in Chinatown. That's like our mission. I don't want to use the maid pills. She want my minions. Let's see the objective clipboard. Explore and find collectibles. Oh, that's that's all we're doing. This is just like collectibles now. Okay, so I guess we're done the game then. Supposedly, let's grab a car and let's drive to that other area and take a look at it. See what else we can come across there. We did do the main story. It sounds like. How do I get in this car? Oh, there we go. The Master Chief is driving a regular vehicle. Off we go! To the island! There's all these like little sign spots. I guess you could go off and explore and take in. Kind of a overall cool level, eh? I think if you're a Minions pal or a friend, or if you like the Minions series, uh, you're a fan of it, you might find it fun. The, the young ones might enjoy this too because of that. That's kind of the general thoughts, though, I suppose, on it. Is this like the hometown area? The hometown neighborhood or whatever? I'm gonna be setting off, sent off this way. Lunch to vandalize. I don't want to vandalize this. Am I supposed to go in this house? I don't exactly know what it's wanting me to do. To break into this house? Oh, it's my home. Is it trying to send me to my home? What? Hmm. Yeah, we've already been in the home. Ooh, what do we have over there? Is that another collectible? Macaroni rocket prototype. Oh, those are collectibles. It's the macaroni thing. Oh, so that's what it's trying to send me to do is like go do the collectibles or something To Rikers Island. That's that's funny Go back into the lair and then see if there's any like side spots we can go to. All right, so we got like a pretty big map Let's let's see if we can put out the uh, the hollow map though and take a look at that See what we're dealing with here we didn't know that. It's like a flying thing. Hmm. Chinatown. Oh, stupid fart bomb. <laughs> hey, Chinatown. Brat's Lair. I feel like we, we did Brat's Lair. The Evil Submarine. San Francisco. 
Spectre's Fortress, which I think we did Fridonia. Okay, let's go El Machio's Mansion. So we can take a look what this is. Is this like a new mission or is it just like a place to visit? I don't want to defeat the enemy thing there. There's a banana. Okay, so they've just recreated a bunch of the different areas so that you can go and visit them if you'd like to. Oh, that's kind of cool. Well, there's like a whole like area thing out there. Oh, it's the minions. Oh no. And then they got random battle events for you to do. Oh, that's kind of cool. I think maybe the main story could have been a bit longer. It's like an hour or so. I think some kids might struggle with some parts though, so it might be a bit more than that. Ooh, it's lair. Then it's lair. Ooh. What do we have here? I'm not sure it's necklace. Okay, so that is collectible. There's nothing really there. Let's see about the submarine. Let's see what the submarine's got. Did we just go into the submarine? Oh, cool. I'm assuming if you're a fan of minions, you're probably like, oh, this is, uh, this is the neat stuff. You know, you're probably like, oh, this is cool. Ah, uh, yes, it's the submarine, actually. I think I know of this. Ooh. There's a lot of collectibles to find. I definitely don't want to sit here gathering all these. I thought there was something happening in Chinatown. That was, like, something I was supposed to find. Maybe it's just, like, an extra... Submarine, Upper Sand, Residential Area, Vector's Fortress, which is on the moon, which we did. Free Donania. I oh, know, maybe Effector's Fortress is different. Let's go take a look at it quickly. Oh, this is that one... I remember this. This is from that, what, the first movie or something like that? Yeah, and there's just, like, another collectible. Okay, I got it. They just wanted to recreate these for fans so they could, like, take a look at the different areas. That's that's cool. You know, that's, that's a nice touch. Huh. Where are the... What's, what's the exit? Oh, and there's like a whole town thing over there? Got it. Yeah, let's go take a look at the Fridonania. Fridonania. Okay, so this is also just like another... This is from the vacation one they did? Or whatever, where he's visiting his brother? It was like Spickle three or something like that. Oh uh, yeah, and then the big rich house over there, and... So you guys spend a lot of time kind of exploring this and doing like little side uh, missions and stuff too, right? There's quite a bit of like little side content on this. Hmm. But yeah, I remember this as well. Uh, this seems to be a pretty good recreation. It's like the whole town area has been brought back here. I, I gotta say, you know, when it comes to creating these worlds, Minecraft, they've, they've really, well not Minecraft, but the creators that have been like handling these properties, they seem to be doing some fancy stuff with it. <gasps> it's the cool fancy weird car thing. And the weird pig things too, and, oh. This is pretty creative. Bruce Mansion, okay, yep. Yeah. It's pretty neat. They're like a secret lair area and everything. Dun 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 Sure fans are finding this really neat though. Okay, let's see. So we've got a bunch of weapons. Have we been everywhere? We we did Fredonia, we did the moon, we did hometown, El Macho's town brand's lair. I think we've done everything that is like a main mission, but I, I could have sworn there was a thing where you had to go and steal back the, the stuff because they took it from you. I was in Chinatown. I I guess I could be mistaken too, I suppose, but... Hmm. Anyways, yeah, this is a pretty cool map, and... Uh, it, was, it was interesting, you know, it was cool to go through. I mean, I didn't... I found the racing part, I, I definitely struggled with that a bit, and I, I could see some kids having issues with that, the younger ones. But I think for the most part, if you, you like minions and that, you're actually gonna come out of this and enjoying it and having a fun time and uh, you know, going out and exploring the world. I think it's kind of neat. We should actually quickly go to creative mode and just kind of do a quick little 
look of the city. So I hate when it does that. When I turn on creative, it should be creative. Like I don't know why I gotta change personal mode every time. I don't want to lose that. Okay. I just kind of want to take a look at the, uh, you know, the overall scope of it. Wow, it's that's actually got like a full San Francisco area, and it's got all these buildings and stuff. That's actually quite creative. Vector's Fortress? Yeah, we, we just kind of visited the Vector's Fortress. That's that's an option uh, in this one. You can go in there. Then they have the San Francisco, like, water, well, Bay Area. I wonder if they do have Alcatraz or not. Do they? And I see some island stuff over there. They seem to have all of the different areas, though, from the, like, the films. I think they've got, like, quite a few different spots you can visit. You know, different fortress areas. Yeah, this is actually quite cool what they're able to recreate within you know the world of minecraft and we are we're done the main mission and stuff guys so this is just kind of like a you know taking a look around and, and seeing you know what what the area is then we got the fancy town area over here and there's like a bit of an aqueducts area oh yeah that's the town we were just at that's the uh this fickle moon Despicable Me 3, I believe, over there. So we went by that place. Yeah, Master Chief's awesome. He's part of the, the Halo pack. I still haven't been able to do the Sonic one. So basically, I've been having a lot of issues with Minecraft. They're, they're giving me coins. Or not coins. They're giving me, like, DLC to unlock these packs. But there's been, like, glitches that I've been dealing with where it's not working. So, yeah, I haven't been able to do... I still want to do Sonic, but... Yeah, it's, it's just been a lot of issues. And there's uh, all this area over here... This, they've got a lot going on in this one. I think people will really appreciate this. And then the giant uh, <laughs> Rubik's Cube thing like that. That's funny. Huh. Anyways, I, I think that uh, basically concludes our, our our tour of the, the world, though. They've, they've done a lot of cool stuff with this one. And, and like I said, you can go further and do extra collectibles. And I think there's an extra little mission thing, if you find it, where you can get something that they stole or whatever but yeah it's kind of kind of neat all the different stuff you can gather the different weapons shrink ray gather the collectible different minions you can have it's it's a cool option yeah it's it's kind of neat huh. oh if you you have to change personal settings to creative as well from like you gotta change both of them to creative otherwise you don't get creative but we checked out i think all the big places right we did that we did all those yeah, I think that about concludes our journey, and, and don't forget to go to the moon because it's pretty cool.